Do you, do you think I'm cute? Yes or no? Yes? <laughs> so, we're done with the um, wedding. Something came up. Okay. Y'all, we at the gas station waiting for this food to pump my gas. My gas. I think I'm going to go by the supermarket again for a second. See if anybody... In there, Mary Kay making love to her shoes. I was just trying to see. Yeah. Oh, never mind. <laughs> My glass is so frosty, I can't even see out of them. Frosty? Out of B. Oh. Okay, I didn't break your glasses. Well, they're not really broken, huh? You just lost the scroll. So y'all, I was trying to say I'm going to shop right for something. Let me turn. We're shop right this way, right? Uh, yeah. Oh, for some bagels. Cause I made that sandwich I made this morning. It will make you want to smack your mama. Hold on. So. So um, I gotta get me some more bagels. Look at this. Look at it in the front. Oh no, not again. Yo. Let me tell y'all something. Y'all know when it be hot, y'all mother fathers don't know how to dress. I be like, are y'all for real though? Like you know. Really? Like for real. For real. For real. You better. I'm a big girl. But I'm a lady. I'm not gonna come out even if I'm a skinny girl, I'm not gonna come outside like a two bit hooker. Looking I mean Yeah. Stank. You got nooks and crannies hanging all out of your shirt. You're, you're, you're disturbing the peace. I can't even drive for looking at you walking on the side of the road like I know you didn't. Okay, I'm done with that. But I'm just saying, look at your life. I got a headache. Who's she talking to? All right, thanks, Tyler. See y'all, cause I have no help here. Holding this, I gotta get me a car mount. Cause nobody helps here. They just sit over on the side and talk junk the entire time. Now she's looking out the window. Yeah, like you on time out. See ya. Uh, her birthday tomorrow. I'm going home and make a homemade card for her. Just look in my closet and see what I can re gift. I see flashes. <laughs> see y'all. <laughs> <laughs> all right y'all i'm home guys it's before 11 o'clock so this is great for me i think i'm gonna um for some reason i think i need to move my eyebrows but anyway um i'm in i got my clothes out already for the morning i'm getting ready to hop in the shower thank god i don't have to do my hair the only thing i will have to do in the morning is my makeup and get dressed basically and i think i'm gonna get up look at it early enough to make me another um sandwich i'm trying to start eating breakfast but we'll see um yeah the wedding was really good it was um it was nice it was an older couple i got married and uh this was i believe the i don't know about him but i know it was her first wedding our first marriage so I'm like you know I feel like you do what you want to do when it's your turn if you've never been married before and this is what you want people who care about you or support you they'll do that like you know I had so many people saying well she almost such and such years old why do all of this why have such a big wedding because that's what she want it's no big deal I mean, if I'm 50, 60, or whatever, when I get married, because, Lord, it looks like I'm going that route. I mean, I'm not even 40 yet, but, Jesus, be a fence. If that's the case, it is what it is, and I'm going to get what I want still. And I expect everybody that I love and that love me to be supportive, and we good to go. Um... So I'm just doing my first stage of makeup removal, which is using my wipe. And then uh, I wash it with my Aveeno Daily Moisturizer. 
and then I follow up with the cream at night. And also very important when you wear a lot of lipstick and especially a lot of matte lipstick. Um, I need to get some makeup removers because this wipe, it comes off. But when it comes to like certain things, like I have glue on my eyelids from lashes I wore the other day. They act like it don't want to come off. So I need that type of remover. But um, I was going to say if you wear a lot of lipsticks, make sure that you always keep your lips hydrated and smooth. So I try to sleep with keep hearing things y'all I try to sleep with um some kind of lip therapy on my um y'all my eyes bother me I was outside for a little bit today after the wedding taking some more pictures and uh number one my sinuses y'all know be cutting up and then it's like my allergies acting out so I got double dosage and my eyes feel so gooey so I know they're going to be leaking like crazy tonight because they already started. But um, I'm cutting in. I'm going to bed early, y'all, because... Y'all can even see my mouth. I'm going to bed early because church has now started in the summertime, the months of June and Ju July. And I think most of August, I guess someone said June, July, and August, our morning worship moves from 11 to 10. So y'all that watch me know the struggle is already real for me to get there at 11 o'clock. I don't know why. Honestly. I mean, if I can get to the work by 9, I should be able to get to church by 11. But my soul is just not moved to get up and go quickly. I mean, I'd be rushing to work. I'm, I'm rushing and late to work every day. So what's the difference? Maybe if I psych myself out and think that I have to be there even earlier, I get there on time without really rushing or thinking about it. Maybe I'll try that. Um, so yeah. We'll see how that goes. My little um, army brat called and she was ripping and running. Got in later. Her flight was delayed. So I'm like, I got to go home. I can't hang around too long. So We'll see. Maybe she'll get dropped off here. But I doubt it. Nobody likes coming out here. They want me to do everything. I'm just like, y'all act like I moved to Timbuktu or in no man's land. There's a lot of people around here. But no, Lisa does everything, you know. Not today. So, we'll hook up later. I'd rather, you know, I know she wants to spend some time with some of the other girls from the dance ministry. So maybe we can all kind of um, do something before she goes back so maybe next weekend would be perfect because we have a big uh well we have a youth explosion coming up on saturday and we have what else their anniversary sunday the choir's anniversary so and my niece's husband my nephew is preaching hallelujah this will be my first time hearing him and i don't know if this is his first time actually preaching but he does he isn't ordained well he is licensed to preach so, we shall see. But y'all, that's it. My TV been on pause forever. It's so sad to hear about Muhammad Ali. You know, I feel like, you know, it's inevitable. We all gonna leave this earth, so people kill me with that. I can't believe it or no, not this one too. Well, we all gonna leave, y'all. The thing is, leave a legacy. Leave something behind that people will remember you for. Even if it's not nationally syndicated, like or on a level where everyone knows. But those people in your life, those people around you, leave a legacy. Something that they will remember you by that's positive. You know, that's what this is all about. Like, you know, I am living this life to live again. And yes, I am not perfect by any means. But I'm striving to be better every day. I'm striving. Y'all know I joke and clown a lot. But I'm striving to do something. To make a change. Somebody every day. So. We'll see. Dang y'all. For real.
And that's probably not even off all the way. Because usually when I do my Clarisonic, I get more off. But it don't be a whole lot. But yeah, I gotta get some makeup wipes. Because these um butt wipes is what I call them. They do the trick, but they're a little rougher than I want it. My makeup wipes are kind of smooth. My pimple over here has gone down. I have a new one coming right on my chin. I mean, what is the problem? It's something going on with my skin. And I think maybe I, I drank a lot of water, but you know what? I kind of slowed down. And speaking of water, y'all. I'm going to get me some watermelon because I hate to waste it. As much as I love it, I haven't eaten any of it that I have here. So, I'm going to take some out and let it warm up. Because, yes, I don't eat no cold watermelon. And i eat a couple pieces of that. Not too much because I don't want to be up all night going to the bathroom. I need my my sleep. Peaceful. So, thank you all so much for watching. Be blessed. And uh, most importantly, be a blessing. See y'all. Smooches. Bye.